XFO, where it's forcing people to change their holiday plans. Hi, Alyssa. Hi, Brian. Travelers here at SFO are experiencing yet another day of cancellations and delays. So far, 17 flights to and from SFO have been canceled because of the weather. Yesterday, more than 100 were canceled. Now, these are mostly short haul flights up and down the state. Delays here are averaging just under an hour, with the longest wait time about three and a half hours. I spoke with a couple travelers affected, one whose flight was canceled and who says he cannot get another one until Christmas day. The second, a man trying to get to a family holiday party down in Los Angeles. They're worried they might not get there in time to celebrate the Christmas holiday with their loved ones. I, oh, I was trying to go to Ohio for Christmas and basically this means that I want to get to spend Christmas with my family this year. Friends hanging out there because we're supposed to be there by six o'clock and but they'll wait for me. The other major Bay Area airports are not having as much trouble. This is video from San Jose International, where there's been just two cancellations. A third of the arrivals and departures there are experiencing delays by 40 minutes or less. And at the Oakland airport, no cancellations, but some delays averaging about 15 minutes. I spoke with an airport manager here at SFO, and he says they're doing their very best to get people home in time for the holidays. But as the weather changes, so do those travel plans. He suggests that people check their flight status at home before they get to the airport and then try and make any changes over the phone or on the internet to avoid long lines. Reporting live at SFO, Alyssa Harrington, CBS 5. Okay, thanks Alyssa. And by the way, you can track the storm anytime with our high